you back. Let's get to the newsroom. John Bogman has some breaking developments for us. John? Well, J.D., as we reported, we heard gunshots, explosions at both locations where these hostages are playing out. We are now hearing from several sources, one being Sky News, another one being Agency France Press, two sources here that both of the brothers, the Kawachi brothers, were killed, likely in this gunfire that you're hearing right now. Uh, they had been holed up at that printing facility for hours today, uh, and there were reports that police had moved in just a few moments ago, but now we are hearing from several sources that both of those brothers uh, the Kawachi brothers, Saeed and Sharif, are now dead. We are also hearing part of the same uh, new round of reports here that the hostage in that situation has been freed and was not hurt. Of course, we also heard police uh, may have also entered that kosher market now where five other hostages had been held. And right up before that, uh, before all the gunfire and the explosions, we had heard that the two hostage takers had told authorities that they would start killing those hostages if anything happened. Uh, to the brothers. And you see that explosion right there. One of the uh, explosions we believe that was part of the police raiding the facility they are going in. But again, Sky News out of Europe and also Al Jazeera France Press reporting now that the two brothers, Saeed and Sharif Kouachi, have been killed now. Uh, we are trying to get more confirmation on that. And you can see even more dramatic video right here of, uh, of the SWAT team moving in. Uh, this is all very raw information, very raw video. Uh, but these uh, events unfolding right before our very eyes, J.D. John Bogman, we appreciate it. We know you will keep us surprised of any other developments from the Newsmax TV newsroom.